Chabahar Port, a gateway to other parts of the world. The port, which became a hub for trade and transit in 2016 with the signing of tripartite agreements between Iran, India, and Afghanistan, is now designed as an effective alternative to Pakistan's ports. A port that continues to strengthen Afghanistan's economic relations by providing easier access to global markets. While Iranian authorities have promised that Afghanistan can use this port for export and import from this moment, the story of Chabahar port is an interesting reality of economic cooperation in the region, which can bring a bright future full of opportunities for Afghanistan. Chabahar port in the southeast of Iran connects this country to the Indian Ocean through the Gulf of Aden and the Arabian Sea. In 2016, Iran, India and Afghanistan signed a tripartite agreement for the development of this port. For Afghanistan, Chabahar can be an alternative to Pakistan's ports, which it currently uses for imports and exports. The previous government of Afghanistan also sought to reduce dependence on Pakistani ports by using Chabahar. A high-ranking Afghan delegation led by Mullah Abdul Ghani Baradar visited Chabahar port during a six-day trip at the official invitation of the Iranian government. During his visit to Chabahar, Mullah Baradar emphasized the need to increase Afghanistan's export and import through this port, and asked Iran to facilitate easier access for Afghan trade through Chabahar port. Iranian officials promised that Afghanistan can export and import from Chabahar port from now on. For Iran, this issue has been like a dream that has come true. And also, Iran has made agreements and memorandums of cooperation regarding the cooperation for the development of the transportation route and connecting the two countries to the Chinese plan of a back road belt. The strategically located Chabahar port will enable Afghanistan to establish new trade and transit partnerships while connecting to international markets with less time and cost. Iran has assured Abdul Ghani Baradar of its support and intention to strengthen Afghanistan's trade through this port. Connecting to Chabahar port gives Afghanistan access to European, Middle Eastern, Indian, and Chinese markets, and thus strengthens Afghanistan's international relations. Chabahar port, tens of kilometers less than Bandar Abbas, and hundreds of kilometers closer than Karachi port, in Pakistan offers a more efficient route, which has led to an unprecedented reduction in export costs and transit time for Kabul. Iran is currently Afghanistan's biggest trading partner. Afghanistan imports 21% of its total imports from Iran. The Taliban government has shown interest in trade through Chabahar port, while Afghan traders say that the Pakistani government has unilaterally banned hundreds of transit goods of Afghan traders at Karachi port and has been preventing the transfer of these goods for several weeks. Currently, according to the decision of the government of Pakistan, 3,380 containers full of transit goods belonging to Afghan traders have been stopped in Karachi port. The total value of these goods is about $2 billion Afghan businessmen have decided not to use the port of Karachi in the future until there is a regular international guarantee. Although Afghan traders are not willing to trade through Pakistan's Karachi port without international guarantees, and still traders are reluctant to trade through Chabahar port due to some problems. If you look at the port of Chabahar, there is no legal permission for goods to enter there and Iran is under U.S. sanctions. Therefore, traders do not want to use this port. Another problem that exists for the export and import of Afghan traders at Chabahar port is that commercial goods reach the Indian port of Bombay through this route, while Afghan traders want their goods to reach the port of Delhi. Also, the time of transferring goods through this port is very long and increases the cost of transporting goods for traders. Before August 2021, Chabahar port was used for trade between Afghanistan and India during the previous regime, especially when the Pakistani government blocked the transfer of grain donated by India to Afghanistan through Wagha port. Then the wheat was transported through India to Afghanistan through Chabahar port. But at that time, the United States had exceptionally allowed wheat to be transported through this port. The Taliban government's attempt to gain access to Chabahar port comes at a time when the group's relationship with Pakistan is strained. 
The Afghanistan Railway Department, whose head has visited Iran's Chabahar port, has said that Afghanistan will soon be connected to Chabahar port through Rosnak Railway and Milk Port in Nimroz. Chabahar port is located in the southeast of Iran and is very important due to its special location. This port is of great importance as the closest access to open waters for countries in the heart of the Asian continent, such as Afghanistan, Turkmenistan, Uzbekistan, Tajikistan, Kyrgyzstan, and Kazakhstan. For this reason, there is a lot of construction going on in this area, including the construction of ports, increasing the loading capacity of large ships in Chabahar Bay, the construction of railway lines to Central Asia, and the construction of an international airport. This port is one of the important north-south commercial crossroads in the world. With its strategic geographical location, Chabahar port plays an important role as a vital option for Afghanistan in terms of trade and transit. This port, which is located in the southeast of Iran, connects Afghanistan directly to the Arabian Sea and the Indian Ocean, and this connection, due to the shorter distance compared to Pakistani ports, leads to the improvement of productivity and the reduction of export and import costs. The signing of Iran's agreements and commitments with Afghanistan shows a serious decision to facilitate trade and promote economic cooperation between the two countries. Considering the importance of this port in the development of Afghanistan's global relations and increasing access to international markets, Criticizing and developing this route from Iran's side can be an important step in strengthening regional and global cooperation with Afghanistan. Chabahar port is an important place in Iran. This is a gateway through which Afghanistan can enter global markets and expand its business. Chabahar port allows Afghan traders to send and fetch their goods faster and with the lowest costs. Iran also has a commitment that Afghanistan can easily use this port. This is a good opportunity for Afghan businessmen who can expand their business and do business with other countries. Thank you for watching.